Today we're at beautiful and glorious Hag Lake in Gaston, Oregon, home of some of the most amazing rainbow trout fishing in the entire state. Oh yes, so rainbow so trout for breakfast. For lunch? Oh, for dinner. For second lunch? For midnight snack. Indeed. You're gonna take your fishing rod here, and this one's already set up. You're gonna have your line coming off of your rod go into a little barrel swivel. That's gonna stop this guy. This is a sliding sinker. He slides back and forth. And on the other end of the swivel, you're gonna tie your leader. Now the leader is important. All you want this leader to do is to float your bait up above whatever might be on the bottom of the lake. And then, and this is where the magic happens, oh. you're gonna take a little finger of this stuff out and roll it into a little ball. So if you squish this power bait on from the bottom of the hook, it covers up the hook just like that. So all the fish sees when they're floating through the water is this power bait bouncing up and down. So that's what I'm gonna use. Chago, what are you using today? So I'm using a... <laughs> well, it certainly is shiny enough. Not even a nibble. Is this the weekend they were supposed to uh, clean the fish? It's once a month, right? Once a month they take out all the fish and wash them. Yeah, you know, well, that's why the fish are so shiny. I mean, because you know what fish do in the water? It's terrible things. There we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, oh, he let it go. Come on! Three fives. Four twos. Lion! <laughs> One, two, three, shoot. Yes. Shoot on four. Yes. Not three. Exactly. Do you have any fours? Go fish. I'm trying. <laughs> I've done this hundreds of times, at least a dozen times. Okay, you're not gonna miss from this close. No, no, no. One, two, three, shoot. Here. <laughs> oh God. Right in the middle, though. Right in the middle. Yeah. All right. It looks like you're aiming a little low. <laughs> no. Nibble. 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 Oh. Yeah, there he is. Yeah. yeah, he really took that hook too. Mm-hmm. He'll fry up. Yeah. That tastes good. Exactly. Alright. Grab yourself a sharp knife and you're going to find the vent on the fish, which is down at this end. What you're gonna do is you're going to insert your knife into the vent, and you're going to slice up the belly all the way up to this portion of the gills. After that, you will go ahead and open up the body cavity and remove all of these guts. Go ahead and save them for later, because trout do like the taste of themselves. Remove the swim bladder and its contents. Now the guts are disposed of, you can go ahead and take that same knife and remove the scales. I like to get a good grip on the tail and gently scrape towards the head, removing all the shiny bits. Most people don't like the feeling of scales in their mouths. Turn to the other side and repeat. Give it a quick rinse in the water and you've got yourself a clean fish. No, the trout's not bad. Oh. Fantastic. And we're out of gas.